She's just a little shy. Put your shield, then you know I love you now as I loved you then. Though you may be trying sometimes, and I need you, and you're not there, you know I may get mad and turn away. But you know that I still care. Don't lose the feeling that you had. Though you grow an old now, and I'm watching you grow, I know I make you sad sometimes. I see a feeling show, but one day I'll look around and you will be grown. You'll be out in the world, such a pretty girl. You'll be on your own, and I'd like to know it. Now it's there, the feeling. Yeah.
always hurt me. Yours it. I don't even know the first thing about what they're feeling. What am I afraid of? Don't know what I'm made of. Can I go on not knowing? Feeling. Something tells me that it's more than I can deal with. Though I never knew the song, some words still catch on like caring and sharing, being together no matter. Can I go on not knowing? Don't know what I'm made of. Why am I afraid of feeling, feeling? If I dare to take a chance. Would someone leave me? No alert is now in effect. No automobiles are to be driven without snow tires or chains. Winds up to 45 miles per hour. Great dinner. <laughs> that baby. Your grandfather. Our daughter's fine. themselves. Well, this is why son looks real fine, don't he? Marion, please, no more matchmaking. Did you make the decision about that new school yet? There's no decision to make. But, honey, it's a chance with the teacher in the high school. Get away from that kindergarten once and for all. <laughs> it's more money. But besides the money, it's a chance for you to be with older students. Almost adults. I like it with the kids, Aunt Anne. Oh, I know you do, honey. <laughs> and you're a fine teacher. That's why I think we'd enjoy teaching high school. <laughs> Have a chance to be with the students for four years. Such an important time in their development. I'm really happy with the kids, Aunt Anne. But you've been there for three years already. It's time you got out of that sandbox and into some new people, new neighborhood. Girl, do you know you're 24 years old and you've never, never been, been south, south of 125th, 125th Street? Street. <laughs> well, you haven't. <laughs> oh, here we go again. Oh, you get me so worked up that I begin to sound like a Jewish mother. I can't see how going south of 125th Street ever made anybody's life better. And you're never going to know unless you try. Are you? Come on, Annie, and let me do that. Why don't you go in and relax? I can do Let me, let me do this. I know getting out in that world ain't easy, even Uncle Henry and me. But we'll always be here for you, Dorothy. And whatever your fears are, well, they'll be defeated just by facing up to them. Now, you take that new job and find a place for you and Toto. It's time for you to make a home of your own.
Toto! 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 Mama? Lay back, honey. We just want to lay a little thanks on you. What? You know, heavy on the gratitude department. Gratitude for what? For curling the curse. For leveling the leech. For killing our oppressor. Uh, I never killed nothing in my life. Never killed a point. Never killed a pie. A good story. An empire. No. Never killed no time. No, I just... I never killed nothing in my life. <laughs> well, then, I think you just graduated uh. from the Bush Leagues into the majors, girl. Can you dig this? No more is. Thanks to you, it's a was. Yeah! She was ever mean. The wicked was from the east, and they didn't call her ever mean for nothing. Oh, she was the parks department commissioner. Photos painting on her playground wall. Turned us into graffiti. And there we stayed, flat, splat, and stuck like that. Doomed as cartoons forever. Till you burned alphabet through the sky and ended the curse. And the curseress given a new lease on life to us, the munchkins, most recently referred to as the Curseys. Toto, let's hear it for Super Witch and our Wonder Dog! Two more things and who do we appreciate? Digits, let me lay my 2020s on you. Yeah. Oh, how I love you. Let me count the ways. Oh, my mom, mom, mom. Innumerable blessings, countless felicitations. Thank you beyond number and additional good stuff. I, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to kill her. Oh, don't be at all sixes and sevens, honey. You did the world a multitudinous service by 86 and old ever mean. Bottom line, honey, this chick put the ugly and ugly. But she sure had pretty shoes, didn't she? Yeah! <laughs> these shoes I want to go home oh I wouldn't discount those shoes honey and don't ever take them off until you do get home remember miss one told you oh pardon me miss one's the name and if you haven't guessed by now numbers is my game and now that you've freed us we can all go back to running our business <sighs> we can all go back to running our business we can all go back to running our business but where am I where am I Land, the indivisible land of Oz. Oz? Where's my home? Where's Annie? Where's New York? New York, 433 Prospect Place. Numbers, I just want to get home. Oh, well, now that all ever means numbers up, that leaves only three, which is an Oz. One, myself. But my powers don't amount to much. And number two, Glenda, the good witch of the South. Oh, she's a real star, but you can hardly catch her in. And number three, the multi horrid Evelyn, the wicked witch of the West. Ever means even uglier sister. But I don't think it'd be a good time to ask her for a favor. 
So I figured the odds are only the Wiz could cipher how to get you back to which is of that place was. The Wiz? What's a Wiz? What's a... What's a Wiz? Oh, darling, he's the ultimate. Yeah! The ex-quotient, the new man, the common denominator, the main man, the head honcho. Bottom line, honey, numero uno. Where is he? How do I find him? Catch this number, honey. Sweet thing, let me tell you about the world and the way things are about. You've come from a different place, and I know you've traveled far right. Now that you told me what it is, I'd better point you towards the whiz. He's the man, he's the only one who can give your wish right to you. He'll send you back through time by running magic through ya. All of the superpowers is. Listen, and I'll tell you where he is. He's the whiz and he lives in us. There's the way to the Emerald City. That's not too far, is it? Just take your dilemma, child, and lay it on the wizard. He'll fix you a drink that'll bubble and fall. And in a flash, you will be home. He's the whiz, he's the wizard of ours. He's got magic up his sleeve. And you know, without his help, it would be impossible to leave. Fantastic powers at his command. And I'm sure that he will understand. He's a wiz and he lives in Things I die. No, I'd better point you towards the to the Emerald City. Oh, just count your blessings and cut your losses and follow the Yellow Brick Road. The Yellow Brick Road? Yeah! The, the Yellow, Yellow Brick Road! road. Ta-da! Remember, don't ever take those shoes off and watch out for the paws and poppies! Wait!
Miss One. Miss One. That I cannot hide, and I know I've tried, but it's turning me around. I'm not sure that I'm aware if I'm up or down. Or here or there, I need both feet on the ground. Maybe I'm just going crazy. Let myself get out tight. I'm acting just like a baby. But I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be all right. Soon as I get home. <laughs> Soon as I get. Brother Crows, this is good stuff here. I'm glad you fellas enjoying your breakfast. Hey, fellas, is today the day you gonna help me get down from here? Help you down? Man, what is going down in that hayloft you call 
all ahead. Didn't we tell you yesterday and the day before that and the day before that? That you can't get down. This is your life, buddy, all hung up. <laughs> Besides, Clyde, us crows are just thinking of you. They ain't nothing to get down for. <laughs> but I was just thinking, just once, fellas, for a little while, just to take a walk in my garden. Wouldn't that be terrific, fellas? Walk? You can't walk! Why, you just a straw paper dummy! You're right, fellas. I was just being selfish. And stupid as usual! But I was reading this morning that most people... Oh, yeah, fellas, yeah, please! Yeah, God, yeah, yeah. Didn't we tell you reading was a waste of time? But, but Bacon here said... Bacon? Once over lightly, please! <laughs> Knowledge is power! <laughs> <laughs> See, in the... Cicero, why he Cicero, says ro, ro, more ro, men ro, are ro, ennobled ro, by study than by nature. Oh, yeah. 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 And over here, um, especially apropos of my situation, i.e., stuck up on this here pole, do not accept any situation, question, argue, and explore. <laughs> now, who you gonna believe? Mr. Nobody on that, that old piece Fellas, of please. paper? please. Or your good friends, the crows. Yeah, who have dedicated their lives to educating you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds to me, fellas, like old garbage guts here done forgot the crow commandments again. Fellas, oh. I did not forget the crow commandments, please. Run them by me, run them by me. Thou shalt honor all crows. Right on, right on. Proceed. Thou shalt stop reading all bits of paper and literature. Trash, terrific. And the most important uh, one. Thou shalt never, never get down off of this here pole. You, you got, got it, Clyde. <laughs> and the crow anthem. I got to sing that thing again. You got to look ready right till you get it. Elucidate. Reiterate. And single bait. You can't win.
is a hopeless failure. <laughs> no, I'm not. Maria. You're just a product of some negative thinking. <laughs> First thing we have to do is get rid of these screws. Come on, Toto, sick them. Get down! Good boy, Toto. <laughs> we can go now. <laughs> yes, you are. Just a little self-confidence and, and coordination. And you're gonna be fine. You mean all this time the only thing standing between hanging up there and living it up down here were those rows? Well, they told you you couldn't do it. And you believed them. If I only had a brain. I would have figured that out a long time ago. There you go with that negative thinking again. Everybody has a brain. Mm-mm. Not me. Ignorance. It's the night of the mind. A night without moon or star. Confucius said that. I'm on my way to find the whiz. He's gonna get me back home. Well, that's nice. Thank you. And good luck. I, I thought maybe, maybe he could get you a brain. You think that he could? If Toto and me, we could share you some company. Besides, you have nothing to lose. I don't, do I? That was so smart of you. I wish I thought of that. Indications are it would be very advantageous for me to join you. <laughs> Good. <laughs> um, we only have one problem. The munchkin said to follow the yellow brick road, but I haven't been able to find it. Yellow brick road. There it is! Hey, wait! Wait! Did you say yellow brick road? Yes? Look over here! We don't need no cabs. <laughs> Say, what's your name? My name is Dorothy. Dorothy and Toto. What intelligent name. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Dorothy and Toto, seems like we're gonna have to find our own yellow brick road. He's on down. He's on down, down the road. There it is. <laughs> Ease on down. <laughs> Ease on down the road. Oh. Oh. Don't you carry nothing that might be a load. There it is. Oh. Look, oh. 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 Oh.
bit of a squeeze, brother. Can you give me a hand? Uh, uh, Dorothy. Uh, how terrible. Don't move. Don't worry. I wasn't planning any promenades. We'll be right back. He's so brave. He's probably in shock. Oh, what I wouldn't give to be in shock just once. Ah! I'm so... I'm so sorry. No apology necessary. I told you nothing hurts me. I have no feelings. Ah! The genius who created me only took care of my dashing good looks, my razor-sharp wit, and my irresistible attraction to the wrong women. Ah! What he forgot to add was a heart. But everyone has a heart. Alas, everyone but yours truly. Nobody home in Soulville. Rid of you! Free from your posterior prison, you hulking she-devil. <laughs> Don't hear you laughing now. We were abandoned here when this park went El Foldo. Ah, oh, it was a sad day. There's not much amusement to the closing down of an amusement park. But yours truly is an old trooper, and I quickly made plans for the future. But alas... I was felled by my fourth wife, Teeny. Crushed in my prime. There. How does that feel? But that's the whole tragic point, my friends. What would I do if I could suddenly feel and to know once again, that what I feel is real. I could cry. I could smile. I might lay back for a while. Tell me what, what, what would I do if I could? What would I do if I could reach inside of me and to know how it feels to say, I like what I see, and I'd be more than glad to share all that I have inside of here and the song my heart might bring you'd be more than glad to sing and if tears should fall from my eyes just think of all the wounds they could mend and just think of all the time I could spend just being vulnerable again tell me what 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 would I do? Oh, tell me what? What? What would I do? Oh, tell me what? What? What, what would, would I, I do? If I could feel... Ah! I'm just a miserable hunk of junk! Me! Once the fastest metal mouth on the midway! Frozen! 
ironically, in a position I had assumed all too often. A seat cushion for teeny, 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 teeny. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Teeny, You're so smart. Teeny, teeny. You could come with us to see the Wiz. He's going to get me back home. And he's going to get the Scarecrow some brains. Maybe he could get you a heart. You're not just flim flamming an old flim flammer, are you? <laughs> could I come with you? Of course. A threefold cord is not quickly broken. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? He rested himself crying. So oil! Oil! What? Oil! Find some oil! oil. Some oil! some oil to me let it trickle down my spine if you don't have stp crisco will do just fine slide some to my elbow and to my fingers if you would slide some oil to me girl Woo! don't that feel good Slide some oil to my feet. Look at that. I got toes again. Come on. Slide some oil to my knees. And let me see if I can bend. Slide some oil to me. I'm beginning to feel just fine. Slide some oil down my throat. And let me lubricate my mind. Shoulder blade. Those who don't have to lubricate, sure got it made. Slide some oil to me. Let it slip down my side. Laying there in one position, sure done made me tired. Now watch me dance. Tossles, don't fail me now. Aha, falling line and get left behind.
you need more oil? No! That beast! He's checking us out! Oh. It's just a statue. Made of stone, see? Not even a dummy like me. Not a stone lion. Can't ch check you out. Say what you wanna, but I'm here to stay, cause I'm a mean old lion. <laughs> you can go where you're gonna, but don't get in my way, I'm a mean old lion. You'll be standing in a trail. Slot machine. <laughs> you don't give much love. He bit my paw. King of the jungle. King of the cowards. You ought to be ashamed of yourself scaring us like that. You big scaredy cat! I can't scare anything. I can't even scare a, 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 a scarecrow or, or a tin man or a little puppy. I can't scare anything. Oh, it's no wonder they drummed me out of the jungle. I O B K. I O B K? Incapable of being king. No, wait, wait, wait. I was exiled. In disgrace. I thought I'd be safe here. No one would discover my terrible secret. Uh, that I'm a lion without any courage. Uneasy lies the head. 
that wears a crown. W. Shakespeare. Well, I thought I'd seen them all. But never, never have I seen a lion without courage. <laughs> Maybe the whiz could give you some courage. It's a good idea. Capital suggestion. Capital. Mm. He's going to get me a heart. And me some brain. Come with us to Emerald City. I'd love to. But I can't. But why? would be so proud going to see the wheels. <laughs> <laughs> My mama used to always say to me, Fleet! Fleet! That's my name. Fleetwood Coop Deville. Mama had high ideas. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah! <laughs> mm -hmm. I ain't too happy on the ground, y'all. How does he do that? It's just a hoax, my friend. He's got a little motor in his pocket.
Like I say, you stick with the big kitty, and you'll be in the heaven. Out of the frying pan into the... This is like a setup. Don't be dead. Oh, please don't be dead. Oh, all is lost. <laughs> How high the moon soars over the hill. What's happening, man? Hey, lions, okay? Hey, Come and cry over here. Come on. So I was a king, a lion amongst lions, ruler of a beautiful kingdom by a waterfall, attended by butterflies and sparrows, and now banished for lack of courage. I, I cannot even protect these precious friends who have been so kind to me. Oh, I'm strong and brave in the subway. Only to be foolish and weak again, I led us into the very jaws of death. Ah, oh, let me end it all. Oh, 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 no, oh, no, let me oh, slaughter to the bow with him. It's all right, Brian, it's all right. <laughs> Everything's all right. The worst is over, my furry friend. <laughs> Would you lay an appropriate quote on this poor beastie, brother? Showers expected late tomorrow. <laughs> Lion. There is a place we'll go where there is mostly quiet. Flowers and butterflies, a rainbow lives beside. 
excited and from a velvet sky a summer storm you can feel the coolness But you're still warm. And then a mighty roar will start the sky to cry. But not even lightning will be frightening my lion. And with no fear inside, no need to run, no need. You're standing strong and tall. You're the bravest of them all. If on courage you must call, then just keep on trying and trying. Brother, this place is nice. The service entrance is at the side. Oh, hold on there, so but we're here to see the Wiz. Yeah, yeah, yeah the Wiz. This is where the Wiz lives, isn't it? May I welcome you to the Emerald City?
and green to show that your stuff's laid. If you're not seen green. announcement from the great and powerful Oz. I thought it over and green is dead till I changed my mind the color's red. children here.
announcement from the great and powerful Oz. Send up the one with the silver slippers. You go ahead, Dorothy. He who hesitates, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Uh, I'd like to speak to the Wiz. Hey, Mike. Excuse me, Excuse me sir. sir. Mr. Wiz. Speed. I'm not alone, sir. I'm here with my three companions and my dog Toto. Forget it. No riffraff. Ah, <laughs> uh, they're not riffraff, sir. They're my friends, and they've traveled very far to see you. <laughs> I said, forget it. Then, then I'm not coming up there. See my friend, sir, or you forget it. <laughs> Send up the riff, Raph. <laughs>
brain, your majesty. Some of your great wisdom. Uh, and this is the Ten Man. I've been a two-bit carny hustler all my life. And I want a heart for mighty and powerful whiz. A heart so I can love all humanity. And what do you want, you all the stuffed animal cracker? Oh, to get the hell out of here! He wants some courage, sir. So he can go back to his old job of being king of the jungle. Is this so lying? Anything she says. Can you help us, sir? What's in it for me? We'd be very grateful. <laughs> yuck, 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 yuck. <laughs> How about your pretty silver slipper? No! No! You dare! The Great Oz has decided not to grant any of your wishes unless, unless you, Dorothy, kill Evelyn, the wicked witch of the West. The Great Oz! I'm sorry I dragged you all here. Look how it turned out. Have you made your decision yet, Dorothy? I don't think there's any choice. Well, Dorothy, you don't have to do it. We could stay right here. Hey, the Emerald City is not a bad place. Get a small apartment, chip in together. Hey, I bet in no time we fit right in. But I could never be happy here. Besides, I'd never get home. I have to go all the way. Even if it means to Eveline. Come on, Toto. Good boy. Then I'm going with you. Likewise. Me too. Which road do we take? Road? <laughs> this one. And you may be sorry. Then how do we find Evelyn? Don't worry. She'll find you.
Dorothy the Scarecrow, the Tin Man, the Lion, and the Dog, too. How do you want? White bread or rye? <laughs> <laughs> you 
get smart with me and I'll send you back to your cages. Now get Dorothy and don't damage those silver slippers! <laughs> Would you like sauerkraut or mustard, my dear? <laughs> On your hot dog! <laughs> Toto! Toto! No! No! <laughs> Toto! No, no, don't you dare, Toto! Toto! Now will you give me those shoes? Yes! 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 That's what I thought. Ha! 
hurry up with those shoes! <laughs> Cause there's a reason to rejoice, you see. Everybody look up and feel the hope that we've been waiting on.
are we? This must be the back door. Well, I don't think the killers of the Wicked Witch of the West should be using the back door. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Cheetah says it's a shortcut. Goodbye, Cheetah. Goodbye, Dorothy. Bye. It's open. Hello? Hello in there? Wait. Wait a minute. Does this look familiar? Guess who got head? Burnham said there's a sucker born every minute. I heard him. I was there when he said it. But I never thought I'd be one of them. Pony! You're nothing but a pony! I'm out! The wizard's out! He's not here! He's out! Lies! No more lies! You shot for I've seen men shot for less. You're a terrible man! I'm sorry. Everything you say about me is true. I'm a phony. I got no powers. I got no right to be pretending to be the wings. I got nothing. Focus, focus. I'm just playing old Herman Smith from Atlantic City. Atlantic City? Atlantic City? You mean you're from New Jersey? Mm-hmm. I'm just a second-rate politician from District 7. Public office is the last refuge of the incompetent. Penrose! Incompetent! <laughs> That's me. I'm incompetent. So much so, I can never get elected to public office. Not because I didn't try. I tried everything. Look, look. I've ran for any and everything. Ultimate. Councilman. Assembly leader. I became a laughing stock. I couldn't even get on the ticket. <laughs> Finally, in desperation, I ran for dog catcher. <laughs> I like animals, don't get me wrong. I like animals. <laughs> but I was at the end of my rope. I plunged myself into the campaign. One desperate grandstand play, you know what I did? I ran in a hot air. Hot air. That's a perfect vehicle for you. No, 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 no. Oh, it was a beautiful Fourth of July day. I planned to fly over the boardwalk and, and the beach from the leaflet to the astonished crowd below. My motto was, vote for Smith, your best bet to catch that pet. But just when I got up in the balloon, a terrible storm came up. He blew me into the clouds. I got lost. I landed here in Oz. They never seen a party of one like mine before. And I know I should have told them the truth, but they proclaimed me the wizard. Now I needed the job. And you me. You sent us to kill Evelyn! <laughs> We might never come back. She would have killed me. She would have found out I had no power and she did a profile. That's no excuse. Come on. Please, please don't, don't go. I, I live here all alone. In terror. That someone will find out fraud. Please. Just stay with me for a little while. Talk. You can talk to me crazy. Call me names.
Now I'll never get my brain. Nor my heart. Or my courage. But you don't need them now. Because you've had them all along. Scarecrow. Scarecrow. You're the one who figured out how to find the yellow brick road and, and how to destroy Eveline in every smart move we've made. Didn't you? Didn't you? And Lion, you wouldn't even give up when Eveline strung you up by your tail. And Tin Man, you have more heart than anyone I've ever known. Honest. Yes. You never needed anything from a fake wizard anyway. If you believe within your heart, you'll know that no one can change the path that you must go. Believe what you feel and know you're right because the time will come around when you say it's yours. Believe there's a reason to be. Believe you can make time stand still. You know from the moment you try, if you What about you, Dorothy? You'll never get home. I guess you stuck the toto in me. Glinda, the good witch of the south. She has great powers. Hello, Dar. Please, is there a way for me to get home? Well, Dorothy, you were wise and good enough to help your friends find what was inside them all the time. That's true for you also. Home? Inside me? I don't understand. Home is a place we all must find, child. It's not just a place where you eat or sleep. 
home is knowing. Knowing your mind. Knowing your heart. Knowing your courage. If we know ourselves, we're always home. Anywhere. If you believe within your heart, you'll know that no one can change the path that you must go. You're right because the time will come around when you'll say it's yours. Believe that you can go home. Believe you can float on air. Clicking my heels three times. Uh huh. Dorothy, can you do something for me? They've had what they've been searching for in them all along. I don't know what's in you. You'll have to find that out for yourself. But I do know one thing you'll never find it in the safety of this room. I tried that all my life. It doesn't work. There's a whole world out there. And you'll have to begin by letting people see who you really are. Success. Fame and fortune. They're all illusions. All there is that is real. is the friendship. That two can share. That's beautiful. Who said that? I did. <laughs> I think of you all the time. And I miss you. Every day. Even if I had to go back to that junk pile. Even as teeny's seat cushion, I wouldn't mind because I have known real love. Oh, don't rush yourself. Oh, Dorothy. Hadn't been for you. <clears throat> Still be back on that pedestal. <laughs> Afraid to live. Me too. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for being my friend. I'm ready now. Think of home. Think of home. 
might think of a place where there's love overflowing. I wish I was home. I wish I was back there with the things I've been knowing. When that makes the tall trees bend into leaning, suddenly the snowflakes that fall have a meaning, sprinkling the scene makes it all. Maybe there's a chance for me to go back now that I have some direction. It would sure be nice to be back home where there's love and affection. And just maybe I can convince time to slow up. Given me enough time in my life to grow up. Time, be my friend. Let me start again. Suddenly my world's gone and changed its face, but I still know where I'm going. I have had my mind spun around in space, and yet I've watched it grow. And if you're listening, God, please don't make it hard to know if we should believe the things that we see. Tell us, should we run away? Should we try and stay, or would it be better just to? 